What's up, you guys? It's Starla Pearson or Starla Simmons. Um, I was adopted, so um, my ID says Starla Pearson, but my I found my real mom and dad last year, and their name is Starla Simmons. So I say Starla Pearson slash um, Starla Simmons. Today I wanted to talk to you guys about my cancer story and what I went through. Thank God I'm done with it. I beat it and I'm good. But um, there's still serious things that I have to do day by day just to keep myself from um, getting sick and doing those kind of things. And um, yeah. Uh, I had cancer leukemia for two years in the past, and, um, let's just say it was awful, and I wouldn't wish it on anybody, because sitting in that hospital bed, puking almost every fucking day is not what you want. I had to have a G-tube, too, when I was eating, because I was losing so much weight when I was sick. And also, um, another fallback when I had cancer is they gave me a chemo I was allergic to. I got pancreatitis, and then I ended up, um, not eating or drinking for a month because I had pancreatitis. And that killed me because watching commercials and shit, like they announced Taco Bell and shit, I'm like, I want some, but I couldn't have some. And, um, and... In the way of me getting pancreatitis, I now have diabetes my whole life. And it's really difficult. I have the more serious kind of diabetes. So it's really, like for diabetics, it's really hard to keep your sugars maintained at all times. And it's a daily job on the basis. But um, cancer was one of the things that I went through, leukemia. That was most horrible. I was, you know, I had to get my hair. I chose to get my hair bald when I had my cancer because my food was in clumps and going in my food and, ugh. But, um, also guys, like, for anybody that has cancer or has beat cancer, congratulations to you. I have, um... I have zebra marks all over my legs because when I had cancer, I blew up like a like a balloon, and then when I unswelled, it left stretch marks. But I honestly believe I deserve those stretch marks because of the fact that they're survivor marks. But now I am doing good, and last year when I found my real dad, I found out that he had leukemia at the same time as I did, and... That really messed me up because now I know it's hereditary and I can pass it on to my kids if I'm not careful. You know what I mean? And that's not what I want for my kids at all. It's not what I want. But at the same time, I want kids, but I'm not going to be selfish enough to have kids and then they go through what I went through. You know what I mean? But um, I just wanted you guys to let you know that the cancer story was real. Um, hold up. Let me get the picture of me when I had cancer. Some people just don't believe me that I had cancer and I really think that's selfish of you to say that I didn't go through cancer when you don't even know me. And here you go, here's the proof. That was me at Christmas. See how short my hair was? See how short my hair was, guys? But me and that perky little smile. But yeah, I was in and out of the hospital after my cancer because of my diabetes. Because I have a hard time maintaining my sugars. And if you don't maintain your sugars and your sugars are high, you're going to pee out all your nutrients. I know you don't want to hear this. But you will pee out all your nutrients that hold your weight in. You know what I mean? So it's hard for me to gain weight and because I'm diabetic and it just is what it is and I just hope you guys see that cancer is just not a thing to be to be messing around about not to be joking about it's a real serious thing
But anyways, guys, I'm going to put all my information down at below, my Snapchat, my kick, all that, and um, my other YouTubes are Starla Pearson. Just go to Starla Pearson, and the, I have four. I have four different YouTubes. This one's my new one that has my stories and your opinions and your answers and your questions. Comment below if you have answers or if you have questions, opinions, anything you need to know. Subscribe, um, like, and have a good day, and I'll see you guys on my next video.